I'm David Dewhurst. <laughs> <laughs> nice to be here tonight. Actually, um, I'm 69 years old, uh, though I read at the 71-year-old level. <laughs> I got my last will and testament all worked out. When I die, I am to be cremated, and the ashes are to be thrown in Rick Perry's hair. <laughs> You know, I was, I was showing some out-of-state out of folks around Austin recently, and one of them said, hey, that's, that's a beautiful statue of Rick Perry you all put up there. And I said, that is Rick Perry. You know, one of the things about uh, getting older that I, I enjoy is that you lose your hearing. So you don't have to hear all the bullshit of the world. And you don't have to hear politics. And my definition of politics, poly means more than one, and ticks are blood-sucking parasites. <laughs> And anyway, I only have two areas of interest, and they are Libya and Charlie Sheen. That I care about. And if you have an imagination, you know somebody can be telling you something, and you can what you hear can be a lot more interesting than what the person is actually saying. A woman tonight came up and said a hey, um, rhinoceros is standing on your penis. Now that was interesting. I, that's what I heard. You know. <laughs> <laughs> that was you, you Jesse. <laughs> but I, I have to admit that when I hear somebody three times try to tell me what their name is, I can't hear it, that makes me a little frustrated. And it always reminds me of the old man who wanted to rake leaves in his backyard, but he couldn't find a rake. So he hollers up to his wife who's sitting on the deck and he shouts, Where's the rake? And his wife says, what? And the old man says, he's getting frustrated. He says, I need the rake. <laughs> <laughs> so the wife goes, And the old man says, what? <laughs> and the wife says, I left it behind the bush. <laughs> the more sophisticated of the crowd, the better that one was. <laughs> I think the best reaction to that was a crowd of, of a European crowd I played recently in Germany. And uh, they were great. But they were, well, no, a German audience is different from a, a European audience because a German audience is almost always young people. Uh, the others are different ages. And that is because the, the old Germans uh, uh, still tie their shoes with little Nazis, you know, they're not going to be at the show, so it's just the young people you get. And of course, the Germans are my second favorite people, and uh, my first is everybody else. <laughs> and my books have been, uh, to show you how perverse the Germans are, my books have been translated in German more than any other country in the world. I mean, I'm like Stephen King of Germany. I just... It's very... Anyway, it's very difficult to be David Dewhurst, you know. I have a very hard time to... So, uh, let's have a hand for uh, Josh Allen, if we could. Okay.
tell you what, the man in black is not your father's tequila. <laughs> it's your grandfather's gardener's tequila. <laughs> Left Barber College, searching for knowledge, went to the university. I must confess, sir, this lady professor, she turned me on anthropology. Now I'm a homo erectus, got to connect this bone that I discovered yesterday. Tyrannosaurus lived in the forest died because his heart got in the way dear dr howard come down from your tower and join me for lunch at the y although you're 30 i still think you're pretty let's give it that good old college try Thank you. 